The Åland Islands or Åland, Swedish, Åland IPA, o Land, Finnish, Avenanma, is an archipelago province at the entrance to the Gulf of Bothnia in the Baltic Sea belonging to Finland. It is autonomous, demilitarized and is the only monolingually Swedish-speaking region in Finland. It is the smallest region of Finland, constituting 0.49% of its land area and 0.50% of its population. Åland comprises Fasta Åland on which 90% of the population resides and a further 6,500 skerries and islands to its east. Fasta Åland is separated from the coast of Sweden by 38 kilometers 24 miles of open water to the west. In the east, the Åland archipelago is contiguous with the Finnish archipelago sea, Åland. S only land border is located on the uninhabited skerry of Market, which it shares with Sweden, Åland. S autonomous status means that those provincial powers normally exercised by representatives of the central Finnish government are largely exercised by its own government. Autonomy The autonomous status of the islands was affirmed by a decision made by the League of Nations in 1921 following the Åland Islands dispute. It was reaffirmed within the treaty admitting Finland to the European Union. By law, Åland is politically neutral and entirely demilitarized, and residents are exempt from conscription to the Finnish Defence Forces. The islands were granted extensive autonomy by the Parliament of Finland in the Act on the Autonomy of Åland of 1920, which was later replaced by new legislation by the same name in 1951 and 1991. The Constitution of Finland defines a Constitution of Åland. By referring to this act, Åland remains exclusively Swedish speaking by this act. In connection with Finland's admission to the European Union, a protocol was signed concerning the Åland Islands that stipulates, among other things, that provisions of the European Community Treaty shall not force a change of the existing restrictions for foreigners, i.e., persons who do not enjoy home region rights. Hembigsrat in Åland to acquire and hold real property or to provide certain services. Etymology Åland's original name was in the Proto-Norse language asterisk Åland which means «land of water». In Swedish, this first developed into Åland and eventually into Åland, literally «river land», even though rivers are not a prominent feature of Åland's geography. The Finnish and Estonian names of the island, Avenanma and Avenama perch land", are seen to preserve another form of the old name. Another theory suggests that the Finnish Avenanma would be the original name of the archipelago, from which the Swedish Åland derives. The official name, Landskapé Åland, means, the region of Åland. Landscape is cognate to English, landscape. <laughs> History Members of the Neolithic comb ceramic culture started settling the islands some 7,000 years ago, after the islands had begun to re-emerge from the sea after being pushed down by the weight of the continental ice of the latest ice age. Two Neolithic cultures met on Åland, comb ceramic culture and later pit comb ware culture which spread from the west. Stone Age and Bronze Age people obtained food by hunting seals and birds, fishing, and gathering plants. They also started agriculture early on. In the Iron Age, contacts to Scandinavia were increasing. From the Viking Age there are over 380 documented burial sites and six castle ruins. The Åland Islands formed part of the territory ceded to Russia by Sweden under the Treaty of Fredriksham in September 1809. As a result, they became part of the semi-autonomous Grand Duchy of Finland. During this process, Sweden failed to secure a provision that the islands not be fortified. The issue was important not only for Sweden but also for the United Kingdom, which was concerned that a military presence on the islands could threaten Britain's military and commercial interests. In 1832, Russia started to fortify the islands with the Great Fortress of Bomersund. A combined British and French force of warships and marines captured and destroyed the fortress in 1854 as part of the campaign in the Baltic during the Crimean War. The 1856 Treaty of Paris demilitarized the entire Åland archipelago. During the Finnish Civil War, in 1918, Swedish troops intervened as a peacekeeping force between the Russian troops stationed on the islands and white and red 
Finnish troops who came from Finland over the frozen sea. Historians point out that Sweden may have in reality planned to occupy the islands. Within weeks, the Swedish troops gave way to German troops who occupied Åland by request of the White Conservative Senate of Finland. After 1917, the residents of the islands worked towards having them ceded to Sweden. In 1919 a petition for secession from Finland and integration with Sweden was signed by 96.4% of the voters on the islands, with over 95% in favour. Swedish nationalist sentiments had grown strong particularly as a result of the anti-Swedish tendencies in Finland and Finnish nationalism fueled by Finland's struggle to retain its autonomy and resistance against Russification. The conflict between the Swedish-speaking minority and the Finnish-speaking majority on the mainland, prominent in Finnish politics since the 1840s, contributed to the apprehension of the Allen population about its future in Finland. Finland, however, declined to cede the islands and instead offered them an autonomous status. Nevertheless, the residents did not approve the offer, and the dispute over the islands was submitted to the League of Nations. The latter decided that Finland should retain sovereignty over the province but that the Åland Islands should be made an autonomous territory. Thus Finland was obliged to ensure the residents of the Åland Islands the right to maintain the Swedish language, as well as their own culture and local traditions. At the same time, an international treaty established the neutral status of Åland, prohibiting the placing of military installations or forces on the islands. The combination of disappointment about insufficient support from Sweden in the League of Nations, Swedish disrespect for Åland's demilitarized status in the 1930s, and some feelings of a shared destiny with Finland during and after World War II has changed the islanders. Perception of Åland's relation to Finland from a Swedish province in Finnish possession. 2. An autonomous part of Finland. The islanders enjoyed safety at sea during World War II, as their merchant fleet sailed for both the Allied countries and Germany. Consequently, Åland shipping was not generally attacked as each side rarely knew which cargo was being carried to whom. Finland marked the 150th anniversary of demilitarization of the Åland Islands by issuing a high-value commemorative coin, the 5 euros 150th anniversary of demilitarization of Åland Islands commemorative coin, minted in 2006. The obverse depicts a pine tree, very typical in the Åland Islands. The reverse design features a boat's stern and rudder, with a dove perched on the tiller, a symbol of 150 years of peace. Politics The Åland Islands are governed according to the Act on the Autonomy of Åland and International Treaties. These laws guarantee the islands' autonomy from Finland, which has ultimate sovereignty over them, as well as a demilitarized status. The government of Åland, or Landskapsregering, answers to the Parliament of Åland, or Lagting, in accordance with the principles of parliamentarism. Åland has its own flag and has issued its own postage stamps since 1984. It runs its own police force, and is an associate member of the Nordic Council. The islands are demilitarized, and the population is exempt from conscription. Although Åland autonomy preceded the creation of the regions of Finland, the autonomous government of Åland also has responsibility for the functions undertaken by Finland's regional councils. Åland Post provides postal services to the islands, and is a member of the small European Postal Administration Cooperation. The islands are considered a separate nation. For amateur radio purposes and have their own call sign prefix granted by Finland, OH0, OF0 and OG0 last character is zero. Even though Åland is economically dependent on Finland, independence movement gains wide popularity among people. The Åland Islands are guaranteed representation in the Finnish parliament, to which they elect one representative. Åland also has a different system of political parties from the mainland see list of political parties in Finland. Homeschooling, which was effectively banned in Sweden in 2011, is allowed by the Finnish government. Due to the island's proximity to Sweden and because the islands are Swedish-speaking, a number of Swedish homeschooling families have moved from the Swedish mainland to Åland, including Jonas Himmelstrand, the chairman of the Swedish Association for Homeschooling. <laughs> Administration the State Department of Åland represents the Finnish central government and performs many administrative duties. 
It has a somewhat different function from the other regional administrative agencies, owing to its autonomy. Before 2010, the state administration was handled by the Allen State Provincial Office. Allen has its own postal administration but still uses the Finnish five-digit postal code system, using the number range 22000-22999, with the prefix AX. The lowest numbered postal code is for the capital Mariham, AX 22100, and the highest AX 22950 for Jermo. Municipalities <inaudible> 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 Population as end of December, 2017. Topic. Geography Topic. The Aland Islands occupy a position of strategic importance, as they command one of the entrances to the port of Stockholm, as well as the approaches to the Gulf of Bothnia, in addition to being situated near the Gulf of Finland. The Åland archipelago includes nearly 300 habitable islands, of which about 80 are inhabited, the remainder are merely some 6,200 skerries and desolate rocks. The archipelago is connected to Åland archipelago in the east Finnish, Turunman Saristo, Swedish, Åland Skargard, the archipelago adjacent to the southwest coast of Finland. Together they form the archipelago sea. To the west from Åland is the Sea of Åland and to the north is the Bothnian Sea. The surface of the islands is generally rocky and the soil thin due to glacial stripping at the end of the most recent ice age. The islands also contain many meadows that are home to many different kinds of insects, such as the glanville fritillary butterfly. There are several harbors. The island's landmass occupies a total area of 1,527 square kilometers 590 square miles. 90% of the population live on Fasta Island, which is also the site of the capital town of Mariham. Fasta Island is the largest island in the archipelago. Its area is difficult to estimate due to its irregular shape and coastline, but estimates range from 740 square kilometers to 879 square kilometers to over 1010 square kilometers, depending on what is included or excluded. During the Åland Islands dispute, the parties sought support from different maps of the islands. On the Swedish map, the most densely populated main island dominated, and many skerries were left out. On the Finnish map, many smaller islands or skerries were, for technical reasons, given a slightly exaggerated size. The Swedish map made the islands appear to be closer to the mainland of Sweden than to Finland. The Finnish map stressed the continuity of the archipelago between the main island and mainland Finland, while a greater gap appeared between the islands and the archipelago on the Swedish side. One consequence is the often repeated number of over 6,000 skerries that was given authority by the outcome of the arbitration. Topic: Climate. Topic. Åland has a humid continental climate that is influenced by its maritime position, especially in summer. While summers are cooler than on both the Swedish and Finnish mainland, winters see little difference to the adjacent parts of Sweden and are only narrowly milder than in mainland Finland. Topic. Economy Topic. Åland S economy is heavily dominated by shipping, trade and tourism. Shipping represents about 40% of the economy, with several international carriers owned and operated off Åland. Most companies aside from shipping are small, with fewer than 10 employees. Farming and fishing are important in combination with the food industry. A few high-profile technology companies contribute to a prosperous economy. Wind power is rapidly developing, aiming at reversing the direction in the cables to the mainland in coming years. In December 2011, wind power accounted for 31.5% of Åland's total electricity usage. The main ports are Mariham south, Bergham west, and Langnes on the eastern shore of the main island. Mariham served as the base for the last large oceanic commercial sailing ships in the world. Their final tasks involved bringing Australian wheat to Great Britain, a trade which Alland shipowner Gustav Eriksson kept going until 1947. The ships latterly made only one round trip from South Australia to Britain per year, the Grain Race, after each marathon voyage going back to Mariham to lay up for a few months. 
The ship Pomern, now a museum in Mariham, was one of these last vessels. The abolition of tax-free sales on ferry boats traveling between destinations within the European Union made Finland demand an exception for the Åland Islands on the European Union value-added tax rules. The exception allows for maintained tax-free sales on the ferries between Sweden and Finland provided they stop at Mariham or Langnes and at the airport, but has also made Åland a different tax zone, meaning that tariffs must be levied on goods brought to the islands. Unemployment was 3.9% in January 2014 The Finnish state also collects taxes, duties and fees in Åland. In return, the Finnish government places a sum of money at the disposal of the Åland parliament. The sum is 0.5% of total government income, excluding government loans. If the sum paid to the Finnish state exceeds 0.5%, then any amount above goes back to the Parliament of Åland as diligence money. In 2010 the amount of taxes paid by Åland Islanders comprised 0.7% of the total taxes paid in Finland. According to Eurostat, as of 2006 Åland was the 20th wealthiest of the EU's 268 regions, and the wealthiest in Finland, with a GDP per inhabitant 47% above the EU mean, while the official currency is the euro, most businesses in Åland and officially accept the Swedish krona. Demographics Topic Topic Immigration Topic Topic Births and Deaths Topic Births and Deaths Topic Culture Topic Topic Ethnicity and Language Topic most inhabitants speak Swedish the sole official language as their first language 90.2% in 2009 while 5.0% spoke Finnish the language of instruction in publicly financed schools is Swedish in the rest of Finland. Bilingual municipalities provide schooling both in Finnish and in Swedish. See Allen Swedish for information about the dialect. The issue of the ethnicity of the Allenders, and the correct linguistic classification of their language, remains somewhat sensitive and controversial. They may be considered either ethnic Swedes or Swedish-speaking Finns, but their language is closer to the Aplanska dialect of Sweden than to Finland Swedish. See Languages of Sweden. Regional citizenship or the right of domicile is a prerequisite for voting, standing as a candidate for the Legislative Assembly, or owning and holding real estate situated in unplanned areas of Topic: Religion the majority of the population, 74.5%, belongs to the Evangelical Lutheran Church of Finland. The Åland Islands contain Finland's oldest Christian churches, including St. Olaf's Church, Jamala, which dating from the late 13th century is likely to be the oldest in Finland. The Åland Islands' largest church is the Church of St. George in Sun, dating from shortly after. Sport. Topic. Allen competes in the Biennial Island Games, which it hosted in 1991 and 2009. Allen United and IFK Mariham are the island's leading football clubs. Allen Stags is the island's only rugby union club. Topic. See also. Topic. Topic. References Topic Topic External Links Topic Wikimedia Atlas of Alland Alland Official Site in English Government of Alland in Swedish B seven Baltic Islands Network the example of Aland, autonomy as a minor protector The Aland example, autonomy protects a minority Alandstidningen local newspaper